All right, so I am right outside Walmart. I'm about to go in and show how much of the grocery store is produce versus processed food. Um, I got my food here to film the food cooking demonstration, but I filmed it on a different day. So we're gonna go inside and check it out. They have a wide variety of crops. It's kind of cool. I'm starting to get into the the way down there so that's it for the fresh produce section it's that small section and now we're going into foods that are like imported from different countries and I don't want to get anybody in the video that doesn't want to be filmed but that's basically it and I found these these are my favorite processed snack <laughs> hesitant to film in here just because I don't want to um, film anybody who's going to freak out. But this is basically all the packaged food. It's all in the middle of the grocery store and there's about five or six aisles that are all processed foods. Like this. And this. And all these canned soups and broths. And of course, tomato sauce. There's a lot of tomato sauce here at Walmart. <laughs> okay, just for a little example, nutrition wise, we have creamy peanut butter, but there's also all these like cottonseed oil, soybean, grapeseed. Um, high pressurized oils in there and then sugar so that's pretty much not peanut butter and then we want to compare it to let's say um what's a good one oh yeah raw california almond butter it's just raw almonds so this would be a product that you'd want to buy from walmart it's a little bit pricier but Let's see, this one might... So this one's okay too. There's peanuts and then 1% salt. So it's just peanuts and salt. But these are probably roasted so that obviously changes it. 